make me really, really happy today looking around. First, it's raining, you came. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> Helps to have a tent. <laughs> and the most important thing, you made the choice to come together today. This is a choice that we hope that the rest of the world can look at and imitate. Please imitate what we're doing here. Kiss Whatever the reason that brings us together, I think the most important thing is just to find a reason to come together and collaborate with each other, enjoying moments like this so special that we need so desperately in the world. So for being here, I thank you deeply from my heart on behalf of the Kurukula Center community. Thank you for being here and welcome. Thank you so much, Sean, for your message. Uh, we would now, I would slight change in our program, so we would now love to welcome Mayor Stephanie Burke from the city of Medford. And so, uh, Hello, everyone. Welcome everyone, a little better now. Thank you for braving this rainstorm today. We're so blessed to have the rain coming down on us. On behalf of all the residents of the city of Medford, I welcome you here today to the Curricula Center. It gives me great pleasure to extend our best wishes to all in attendance from so many faiths and religions. Medford is a city rich in ethnic, cultural, and religious diversity. Each community lends its specific attributes and the result is a community that continues to build a city of harmony and cooperation. For many years now, the Kurakula Center has been a vibrant part of the tapestry of the city of Medford. It has brought forth a clear message that listening, contemplating, and meditating from the foundation for a better life for all. I am honored to join, thank you. I am honored to join Geshe, 
the Tibetan Buddhist community, and so many friends and visitors to the Sakadawa Interfaith Celebration and all of our inter interfaith community that is here with us today. It has been a privilege to join with you in, I think this may be my third or fourth Sakadawa ceremony, and I so look forward to the music and customs and, and voices of the interfaith community that will be present today. Thank you very much on behalf of the City of Medford. Most importantly, happy birthday, Buddha. And I join in with you in wishing great, great love and peace in our world. Thank you so much, Mayor. And now we would love to welcome um, Tenzin Damdu from TAB. I believe I just saw him. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Uh, uh, good afternoon. Uh, I was kind of a little late because I went to soccer game. Sorry, I apologize. Uh, and on behalf of uh, all the Tibetans who reside in and around Boston, I would like to say thank you so much, uh, Kurkura Santa, for having this kind of auspicious ceremony. And it's, it's great for the community, uh, for, as, it, as it's myself, a Tibetan. I feel it's very great uh, to be part of Kurkula Center and always, always want to be part of it. And uh, the religious is nothing, it's very simple. It's being kind to the people. His Holiness always says, if you can help others, please don't harm them. That's all I believe. And I think it's, uh, that's what I believe. I think we should all believe. And I think uh, the basic of the uh, old religion is kindness, humanity, giving back to the community. And uh, on behalf of Tibetan, residing in Boston, I would like to say thank you and welcome. Thank you. Oh, okay, sorry. So let me speak it to them. The third year, the Mima Sangma Pyo Anzo Boston, the Yi Mi Sangma Yi Tone Anzo, the Kurgras and the Tochen Nas. Ani Chudani Chulu Lais, Kari Chu Kai Ne, Manche Dir, Mila Yapo Chieche, and Gyeongji Kadusulu Samba, Kizi Mila Pei Matun and Liu Marques. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. And now we would love to welcome um, Muhammad Chowdhury, Mr. Mama Chowdhury from the Bangladeshi Association of Boston. Bangladesh Homi Ki, Muhammad Numen Chowdhury Ki, Ani Sungshit Dorti Jinangyu. Thank you. Uh, good afternoon. Uh, it is pleasure and honor for me to attending. This is the fifth uh, Sakadawa ceremony. It, it is a nice event, like I participated the day they started. And uh, this is the example of the metaphor that we all are inclusion. And it is like a, the community where we all live together, we gather together, and we celebrate together. And thank you, uh, Mayor that uh, make this city so inclusive to the, all the communities. They feel more welcome, including uh, Bangladesh community. So on behalf of Bangladesh uh, Association of New England and Bangladesh community, I say thank you and welcome everybody here. And again, we like to work together and live together, city of Metro, at the great city. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, Mr. Mohammed. 
Um, then um, I would love to now welcome the Curricula Center um, students, students of Gashalas. Um, they'll be reciting a prayer. If you want to follow along, it's on page um, seven in our prayer book. I'm not the prayer book in the program. <laughs> such an honor to be in such a beautiful and auspicious gathering. We'd like to chant with you just a couple of the prayers that we do before our, um, the teachings and whenever we gather there are some regular recitations, prayers, chants that we do. We'll do uh, three short ones for you today. The first is where we honor the Buddha, Dharma, and Sangha. We take refuge in the three rare sublime ones, the triple gem, and request their inspiration, protection, and guidance. Then we make an offering from our heart, imagining offering all the most beautiful and wonderful things in the universe to all beings, so all beings are happy. And then the final prayer is a way of closing um, a dedication may compassion grow in the hearts and minds of every single being. very much Wendy and the group thank you so much uh, now we would love to um, welcome mr. David says who's kind enough to join us here from the temple Shalom in Medford thank you teacher now Wendy the group of Loma number two Tangana Zogi David sayer 
Shalom Gombanet. Can you? Yeah. Thank you so much for welcoming me here. Rabbi David couldn't make it today, so he asked me to speak instead. Uh, this is my first time here, and it's so wonderful uh, when an event can bring all of our different communities in Medford together, because that's truly where there is peace. I'd just like to read to you um, a short reading from the uh, Jewish prayer book. We cannot only pray to you, O God, to end war, for we know that you have made the world in such a way that we must find the path to peace within ourselves and with our neighbors. We cannot only pray to you, O God, to end starvation, for you have already given us the resources for which to feed the entire world if we would only use them wisely. We cannot only pray to you, O God, to root out prejudice, for you have already given us eyes for which to see the good in all people, if we would only use them rightly. We cannot only pray to you, O God, to end despair, for you have already given us the power to clear away slums and to give hope, if we would only use our power justly. We cannot only pray to you, O God, to end disease, for you have already given us great minds with which to search out cures and healings, if we would only use them constructively. Therefore, we pray to you instead, O God, for strength, determination, and willpower, to do instead of only to pray, to become instead of merely to wish. For your sake and for ours, speedily and soon, that our land and world may be safe and that our lives may be blessed. May the words that we pray and the deeds that we do be acceptable before you, O Lord, our rock and our redeemer. Thank you so much. Uh, we'd like to just welcome um, Reverend D. Woodward from um, Grace Episcopal Church in Medford. Thanks. In this very blessed event. My brief words come today from two different directions. The first is the fact that we find ourselves once again grieving the violence that besets our country. And the second is the fact that I am totally unschooled in Buddhism and Buddhist studies. So I've done a little research, and the words I'm going to offer to you, I'm sure most of you already know, but they are brand new to me. So I ask your courtesy, and I will try to tread gently on your traditions. कौन पले को मंदे आह पले अल्लाह नूर यापाया लोग पर मन पूलो पाई पर मन पूलो Good 
कुदरत के सब बंदे एक पाया कुदरत के सब बंदे एक नूर पे सब जग उपजिया कौन पले को मंदे That's one of the most um, common mantras um, of, the, of this tradition. And it, mean, it means, um, literally it means, homage to the jewel and lotus. And so, it, the om is composed of three syllables, the a, ah, the o, and the m, um, standing for the practitioner's um, impure body, speech, and mind. And it also symbolizes that ultimately the exalted body, speech, and mind, that ultimate body that we can all, all develop of the enlightened person, a Buddha. And Mani, as I said, mentions jewel. It symbolizes the altruistic intention to become enlightened. Padme, uh, the lotus, is a symbol of wisdom. And home indicates indivisibility. So um, as we get ready, uh, thank you so much. Thank you. 
Hello everyone. <coughs> I'm first time here. Uh, uh, thanks, Mayor Stephanie and the organization committee. Uh, I'm participating in this one, the event, first time. We have been, I'm also the director in the Paspati Buddha Foundation also, which you may have known. Last year we did a Boston Sapta in Metropol Shivalai Temple, and uh, we have raised a lot of money. And we are trying to, as like you, we are trying to establish a community center in Boston Metro Boston area. So this is my first time. I will send you some Hindu Santi mantras and some Sanskrit mantras and the universal the Om sound which is a message to the world for the peace and which is a single unified human body nature and human musical sound. So let's celebrate with the sound of Om. You may close your eyes and put your hands together with Namaste, all of you know. This is a sound of Om which we're gonna make it, all right? Let's try it. Close your eyes and then start to sing it from your heart with no ambition, with no intention. Just release your body and just sing Om. Let's chant some Krishna's Manda. Om Sachidananda Rupaya Vishwas Patyabhitavi Tapatra Vinasaya Sri Krishnaya Namo Namaha. This is Krishna's mantra. I'm going to chant the Santi mantras. Hari Om Deohu Santi Rantariksha Gum Santi Prithivihi Santi Rapaha Santi Rukhadaya Santi Banaspataya, Santi Biswe Deva, Santi Bama Santi, Sarvagum Santi, Santi Reva Santi, Sama Santi Redi, Hari Om Sostina Indro, Vida Sarvaha, Sostina Pukha, Bisoveda, Sostina Taxio. Aristane me, Sostino Bias Patir Dalatu. This is it for the today. Thank you very much for the listening. Thank you so much. Thank you so much for joining us today. And uh, now we would love to welcome um, Reverend Matthew Rasur uh, from the First Baptist, Baptist Church in Medford. Thank you, Dinesh Dugal. Now I'm an Narazogi Baptist First Baptist Church in Matthews. Matthew Rasu, you should have a name. So, thank you. Thank you. Hello. In the tradition of the Christian Church, Today is the eve of the Feast of Pentecost, or the celebration of Pentecost, uh, which is celebrated 50 days or a week of weeks after Easter. And according to the legends of, uh, of the church, what happened on this day was people were gathered uh, and speaking a variety of different languages. And then a spirit came and uh, allowed them to hear each one in their own language what they were saying. Uh, this is, I can't think of a more appropriate way to celebrate this uh, this blessed holy day. I offer now a traditional prayer for the Feast of Pentecost. Come, Holy Spirit, send forth the heavenly radiance of your light. Come, Father of the poor. Come, giver of gifts. Come, light of the heart. Greatest comforter, sweet guest of the soul, sweet consolation. In labor, rest. In heat, temperance. 
in tears solace. O oh, most blessed light, fill the innermost heart of your faithful. Without your spirit there is nothing in man, nothing that is not harmful. Cleanse that which is unclean, water that which is dry, heal that which is wounded. Bend that which is inflexible, fire that which is chilled, correct what goes astray. Give to your faithful, those who trust in you, the sevenfold gifts. Grant the reward of virtue. Grant the deliverance of salvation. Grant eternal joy. Amen. Good afternoon and birthday blessings to each of us. That spirit that Matt just talked about, our faith teaches is in every living being, every person, an animal, and bird, and fish contains that same divine spark. So if somebody is killed, we all share in the pain, and the Holy One is diminished. And if somebody is seduced into killing by power-crazed tyrants or money-grabbing weapons dealers, we are all sharing in that loss and we are all witnessing the diminishment of the holy. And so we must all stop violence so that the holy one that we all worship and serve and live within and around is not diminished as and brothers. No part of life is separate from me. Their joy and happiness is my joy and happiness. Their suffering and sorrow is my suffering and sorrow. Thank you for all these relatives of mine. They will receive good care from me. Salam, shalom, peace. Grace and blessings not only from my own congregation, but from all of the faith communities in Medford uh, as we represent the Interfaith Clergy Association here today. As my colleague has already, both of my colleagues have already referenced, uh, the Buddha's birthday this year falls on the same weekend as the birthday of the Christian church. Uh, this, this festival of Pentecost that we celebrate uh, is affectionately considered the birthday of the Christian church because thousands of people from many different traditions and cultures shared a miraculous experience and as a result became followers of this guy that we call our savior but who everyone knew as Jesus. In the retelling of that story, it's written that Jesus' disciples were all together in one place. It might have even been pouring down rain at the time, I don't know. And they were waiting. They were waiting. They were waiting for something that Jesus had promised. They were waiting for the Spirit of God that the resurrected Jesus said would be with them to guide them and teach them. They were waiting inside, very quietly. They were waiting, Geshela, where are you? I'm here. <laughs> they were waiting. And then, out of nowhere, there was the is our way if we choose it. Let's choose it, shall we? May it be so. Thank you. Thank you so much, Reverend, for your beautiful message. And now we would love to um, welcome Imam Hassan Morris from the Islamic Center of Range Avenue in Cambridge. Thank you. Kitchena <laughs> Wendy Miller. Pangaranzo Sunshinangi Islam Ashan Waris Islamic Kaji Pangani Sunshinangu. Assalamu alaikum, may peace be upon you all. I'm going to recite a few verses from Quran and then going to translate it in English. A'udhu billahi minash shaytani rajim. 
بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم وقضى ربك ألا تعبدوا إلا إياه وبالوالدين إحسانا إما يبلغن عندك الكبر أحدهما أو كلاهما فلا تقل لهما أف ولا تنهرهما وقل لهما قولا كريما واخفض لهما جناح الظل من الرحمة وقل رب رحمهما كما ربياني صغيرا ربكم أعلم بما في نفوسكم إن تكونوا صالحين فإنه كان للأوابين غفورا وآت ذا القربى وحقه والمسكين وابن السبيل ولا تبذر تبذيرا إن المبذرين كانوا إخوان الشياطين وكان الشيطان لربه كفورا إلى آخره. So this is a few verses uh, from the chapter of uh, Banu Israel. Gisha and all those who organized this beautiful event for this purpose of spreading the love in the community and also I would like to congratulate the <coughs> Mayor of the Medford and all of you. May peace and blessings of God be upon you all. Jazakallah. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, Imam. And now we would love to um, welcome Pastor Gerald Bell from the um, Shallow Baptist Church here in Medford. <laughs> Tangaranzo Baptist Shiro Baptist Church in Shulhagan, Pastor Gerald Bell, Gisunshan Nangyu. This is the day that the Lord has made. We should rejoice and be glad in it. I was glad when they said unto me, Let us go to the house of the Lord. Thy feet shall stand within thy gates, O Jerusalem. I don't know about you, but I'd rather be a gatekeeper in the house of the Lord than to dwell in the tents of the wicked. Has God been good to you? Yes. Has he really been good to you? Yes. Then let the congregation say hallelujah. 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 Amen. Amen. In my tradition, we preach. Amen. Amen. Now, in my tradition, I could start to preach and then we'd be here till tomorrow, but I'm not going to do it. <laughs> do that today. I'd like to share a scripture with you from 1 Corinthians, and I'll begin uh, reading uh, 1 Corinthians 1 verse 19. For it is written, I will do something greater is this. I do not like the word diversity. We are not diverse. Diversity means nothing, but what we represent is the wisdom of God. Your faith and your faith and your culture, your tradition. All of our traditions represent the wisdom of God that can reach all the men and women of the world. There are two questions that they're asking today with regard to violence. The first is why, and the second is what are we going to do about it? I've got answers to both of them. Why? Only God knows. Only God knows. Only God knows. Only God knows why. The second is, what are we going to do? We're going to turn to our faith. We're going to turn to our God. We're going to turn to our beliefs. And we're going to ask God to help us. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, uh, Reverend. And we'd now love to um, welcome Sean. Um, he's going to um, read to us the messages we received from Representative Michael E. Capuano and from Governor Charlie Baker. So, Kurupula Kigenzi Sean Lane, the Governor Charles Baker, Representative uh, Michael E. Capuna. She kept seeking the song she, uh, I mean, the song So from the office of the governor. From the office of the governor. Dear friends, 
On behalf of the Commonwealth of Massachusetts, Lieutenant Governor Polito and I wish to welcome all participants and attendees of the 2018 Sacadawa celebration. Lieutenant Governor Polito and I would like to extend our warmest and best wishes to all those who have come together in commemoration and celebration. This event will surely continue to bring together those of different faiths and religions to celebrate the rich history of interfaith harmony. Once again, Lieutenant Governor Polito and I would like to extend our best wishes for a most joyous and successful celebration. Sincerely, signed Charles D. Baker, Governor, and Karen E. Polito, Lieutenant Governor. From the Office of the Congress of the United States, House of Representatives, Michael E. Capuano. Honoring the fifth annual Sacadawa Interfaith Celebration. Dear friends, I regret that I cannot be with you in person, as I surely am in spirit, as the Kurukula Center for Tibetan Buddhist Studies observes its ninth, fifth annual Sakadawa interfaith celebration. It is wonderful, in a world so divided by senseless animosities, that you choose to recognize and celebrate our shared humanity. I have always believed that being rooted in a cherished tradition should help us understand the beliefs and feelings of others. Being a good Catholic, or a good Christian, or indeed a patriotic American, should give me insight into the loyalties and commitments that sustain other men and women whose upbringing was different from my own. All religious traditions teach us not to be obsessed with ourselves, to regard others as our brothers and sisters whose hopes and dreams are as important to them as our own are to us. Generous patriotism seeks freedom and justice for all people, not to be imposed by force, but to be nurtured and supported by peaceful means. I wish you serenity and enlightenment as you observe the month of the Buddha's birth, and I am grateful for your kind invitation to join you, perhaps another year. Yours sincerely, and with due respect, Michael E. Capuano, Member of Congress. Thank you very much, Sean. Um, and now we would love to, um, we're going to have a little performance from Bangladesh and Susanna Barua, a very, very cute little one. She's going to do a dance for us. And we're, so if you can be a patient, we're just going to set up the music to be ready. Thank you. Sean Lotichina. Bangladesh for me to bang me for much in Jushigi, some shit in Erisha. The most venerable Sangha on this stage and all the representatives from different faiths and different followers of different religions. We all are gathering here to celebrate this year 2,562 Buddhist era, 2,562. This is what we are celebrating, especially Gurukula Center, Learning Center for Tibetan Studies. We all must be very thankful to Venerable Kese 
for making this great opportunity to be here together without any differences. I remember one stanza, the great sayings of the Buddha from Dhammapada. Buddha said in a Dhammapada, Sukho Buddhana Upado, Sukho Sadhamma Desana, Sukho Sangasa Samagi, Samagananta Posukho. When I think about this tensa, this is in the Pali, I like to translate in English, in briefly. And this is what the celebration is about. So thank you very much. And uh, I will hand over the mic, Venerable Dr. Sorata from Sri Lanka to start the chanting and all the Sangha members will get together and chant together. Buddha uh, was born uh, in Nepal uh, 2,600 years ago. So the Buddha, Buddha's language we call the Magadha, Magadha or the Pali language. So you have a lot of translation, the Buddha's teaching in English and the, uh, and the other languages. But the Theravada monks still, we preserve the Buddha's original language. Now we are going to chant uh, according to the original language the Buddha's, uh, Buddha was uh, uh, in, in, in uh, he, he has uh, preach the, the Buddha's language. So please listen to that chanting. This uh, chanting, of course, the, uh, the compassion and loving kindness uh, to all, to uh, be the peace of, uh, for the whole world. So please listen to this chanting. This is also chanting. That's not uh, going to be a long chanting. So please uh, listen to attentively. Namo tasa bhagavato arahato samma sambodhasa Namo tasa bhagavato arahato samma sambodhasa Namo tasa sadhiksa So thank you for listening to our chanting. And may peace and happiness upon you all with the blessings of the Buddha, blessings of the Dhamma, blessings of the Sangha, and blessings of all the enlightened beings. Thank you very much. One moment, let me introduce. Yeah, thank you. Thank you to the Vietnamese Chosun Pohen Temple, Tanwe Kuen Thang, Lumbini Nangche Gompane, Ani Tangwon Temple, Tangasum Ne Kwangsus. Yeah, thank you. We are Vietnamese Mong and Nung. Uh, we are four temples around here. One temple in uh, Lorraine, and one temple in Harrow, one temple in Water, and one temple in uh, oh, Law. Four temples together to come here. Uh, I am very happy to come here because, you know, um, I came here so many times. Um, I am very happy because people different language, different Culture, but but together in here enjoy uh, this uh, ceremony, and then right now we um, together chanting uh, by Vietnamese. I invite everybody close your eye and then together chanting.
Thank you. Uh, take a minute. Tiểu tài càng tường thần chủ nam mô tăng hoàng đa mâu đà nam ma bản ra đề a đa sa ta nàng nam phương kiến ra ảnh thư hệ thư hệ hồng hồng nhập nhập và nhập và ra bản ra nhập và ra bản ra nhập và ra đề sắc xa đề sắc xa sắc đề đề sắc đề đề ta phần ta ta phần ta phiền đề
May you be enlightened to the truth of life and death and blossom into an eternal flower. Step by step, whatever you do will become a divine sutra. Step by step, whatever you do will become a divine sutra. Please close your eyes while I'm chanting the special deliverance chant in Korean. Reverend Kim. And we would now love to um, welcome um, from the uh, Thousand Buddha Tepe Temple, Reverend Sikwan Yen. It's the Sikwan Yen Temple. Kim, Hankum La, Tuchena, Hadije La, Sikwan Wen, Chiktong Nangpal Hagane, Sikwan Wen Thousands Buddhist Temple from Quincy. Dingjang Ala Peruna. Chi 无父之灭道
波舍波耶波罗蜜多咒，即是咒曰：提地提地波罗提地波罗真提地菩提萨婆诃。啊，各位听得到？我刚刚在中国回来第三天，所以时差仲未有回过来，请各位原谅。阿弥陀佛，祝大家如意吉祥。Thank you so much. And now we would love to、um, welcome、um, Lama, Lama Sonam、um, Geshe Denli,、um, Venerable Jamyang, and Anirinchit Kandro from the Tibetan tradition. Thank you so much. Kishin da tanda shendu sungi gemi gemi da Taiwanese ane lani resha tuchena ta dije langaranzo kuru kula gumbagi geshe ladang jagung gumba lama sunam la ane geshe ane ane geshe ma jaya nu toma ladang ane ishe kandula pinche kandula shendu sungi. Thank you so much. It was beautiful. And now we would love to welcome Representative Paul Donato from the Magis <laughs> Massachusetts Legislature. Sungshe nangye tamadi Representative Paul Donato ngade chozo githumi ngaranzo Massachusetts ngade githumi re kurangi sung. May I just say how proud we are to have this center in the city of Medford and the love and the culture and the diversity that your love brings to our community. Those of us in the legislature are very proud of your culture. They're very proud of what you do, but more important, of how you treat your fellow person throughout the country. It is important that we understand that. The Dalai Lama has said that when I was here, and I was privileged to be with the Dalai Lama, and privileged to be with you. So on behalf of our state legislature, on behalf of the people of the city of Medford, we continue to welcome you, we continue to thank you for all you have done, and may God bless you and make sure that you are 
happy in your life. Just handing it over to Geshla. Um, and Geshla will do the thank yous. Thank you very much. Yeah. And the is the The performers come back to we offer you all thank you, Kata. The performers come front. Uh Tatanda I would like to behalf the curriculum center members and my personnel to thank you for all of you, the friends of the Medford, Mayor, my dear friend, Dinaro, all my friends, thank you for coming here, especially for you know, all the members, faith, different faiths, also all the my brothers, sisters from monks, nuns, different faiths. They support us always. They come here. It's very wonderful. Now, our tradition, the Tibetan Buddhism tradition, Buddha's birth is our most important. We all different religions come together to celebrate. It's, I think, the best event. Even though also different faith religions, we all same direction. We're looking for peace, happy. Therefore, we are same place, same time. We pray together. We celebrate together. I think this is the most wonderful. Therefore, I would like to so thank you for all the clergy members, all the friends. Thank you so much. Also, I would like to say thank you for the, all the sponsors. Without your support, we cannot, even we have ideas, we cannot do. Therefore, you know, you help who happen this and support all of you. Without your support also we cannot do. Therefore, I would like to show all the different sponsors. I can I cannot you know mention the every single names, then a very bad memory, I forgot. You know, sometimes you know we say someone, we didn't say someone, say, Oh, they didn't call my name. Therefore, I just like to say thank you for all of you to contribute for our this event. The secondly, also I would like to thank you for all the volunteers. Even if we have the people, we have the sponsors, if we have not volunteers, also we cannot happen this. Therefore, a lot of people work very hard, many days, happen this. Therefore, I would like to show all the volunteers for thank you from behalf of the curriculum center and uh, from myself. And I think like that, even I you know, forgot something, I missed something, so please forgive me. Then uh, everyone, anyone contributed to this event, I would like to say thank you. To the people who are here, 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 to the people then we will take one group picture. Also, the Sanghas have to leave the but Wait, 35 minutes, OK? Thank you, everyone. Uh, can you, can you come to front? The singers perform to come. Thank you. Thank you so much. And so, the the joy, get a number of the Get a number so, Pesho. Get a number of the Pesho. 
so as a as a closing, we are doing the um, a prayer that was composed by His Holiness the 14th Dalai Lama, and that is on page 10 in the program. Tangaranzo gela namba gela namba din la ferona ngazo gave shabte suyare. And if you wish to show that, take the show that you want to do, someone will do it. 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 Someone will do so much and now we just welcome um, Lama Sonam to make a quick announcement.
Tanda bawa kerja ni di kumpulan tu pas charger na. Bawa kerja kumpulan tu kat charger na.